Okay. So we can, after the competition, explain you a little bit things how to dance better. So it's very, very simple. So what was wrong a little bit? So when you dance on competition, I feel like anytime you want to bring your right leg forward, so it's only the leg. And then you add the body. So you do leg, then body. So in Latin dances, we have something like called merengue action. It's like this, it goes like this. Leg, then body action. Leg, body. Leg, body. Leg, body. But for our Latin dance, this is not fit very well. So you want to change a little bit idea how we're going to move. Doesn't matter what dance. Especially like cha cha, ramba, samba. So what is the formula? How to move? What move first? What move second? So if you look at your body, you have no, stay like this, stay like this. You have this upper body. You have middle of the body, and you have your feet, lower body. So watch. What do you think? Which moves first? Which moves second? Which moves third? All together. All together. <laughs> so. Uh, the first, what we're gonna move, it's a middle. Mm -hmm. Then we're gonna move upper, and only then we're gonna move lower, which is your leg. Okay. So that's the formula. We're gonna move middle, then upper, then lower. Mm -hmm. So what it means? Middle is what? It's your hip. So we're gonna rotate our hip around standing leg, but we're gonna rotate in very specific way. So when you rotate, I want you to rotate in a way where it will pushing your chest forward, this part. Mm -hmm. Up on opposite side, on opposite. That's the most important to understand. So when you wanna bring your uh, right leg forward, for example, you have to work your opposite side for that. Mm -hmm. so that's, that's kind of the different thinking. Not like, oh, I step forward with the right, I'm working right. No, that's not gonna work for us. So we wanna work opposite side. So number one, Middle part is a hip rotation. In a way, it starts from the back, pushing your chest forward. So hip rotation, chest, and only then leg. Mm -hmm. Got it? So middle body start first, upper body start second, and the leg start third. So try that. Let's go. And da. Now, when you move your leg, the leg arrives in very specific way. So I rotate my standing leg, chest go forward. Chest is your direction now. Leg goes second. And when leg goes, which chest should be on top of the foot and uh, leg go on the ball of the foot. And then absorb through the heel. And then you land in this position. Got it? So land through that climb land feeling. Ball heel. Got it? So go. Rotate, yeah, hip. Upper body, leg. No, again, again. No, not very clear. Hip, upper body. Don't send this arm back. Let this upper body go forward. Hip, upper body, leg. Climb the land. Hip then. Hip, yeah. upper body, leg. Climb the land. Okay. From this position, when you move, what you need to complete the steps. You're going to continue spine forward to finish the hip. No, no, no. no don't. Just align it. So this is we call line of balance. So hip on top of the uh, shoulder on top of the hip. Yeah, shoulder on top of the hip, on top of the foot. Okay, and from here process repeats. What are you gonna do? So in order to rotate here, we're gonna add little secret. You're gonna go inside and around, rotate to activate the chest. So this is what moves forward, not the leg. Okay. More, more, more till here, and then the leg activates. Boom. Then complete line of balance and again. And hip, chest, leg. Complete. Yeah. Try to go this way. Very good. Mm -hmm. From here, this way. You're going to go this way. Yeah. Hip rotation, chest, leg. Now from here, you're going to move your spine forward to complete the step. So pendulum change. Now here, hip rotation, like. Lift, rotate. Now this is goes forward, then leg. Very good. And so in order, you see, in order to move your left or right leg forward, we need to work our opposite side. Uh -huh. uh, mainly it's opposite hip. So if you want to, let's say, step forward with the right, you have to work left hip. Complete right. 
Now, if you want to move uh, left leg forward, you're going to work right here. Boom. Very good. Very good. Yes, very good. So if we do, for example, a samba, crossado walk, exactly the same idea. So if we stay here, hip is back, knee is bent. So now we bring hip, hip and uh, shoulder with the leg in one line. Now from here, we start working our hip to activate the chest forward. So this is what moves forward. And after the chest, the legs arrive. And again, hip, upper body, leg. Hip, upper body, leg. Hip, upper body, leg. Right. Let's say we do cha-cha-cha. I don't know, like, like lock step, cha-cha-cha. So go. If you want to step forward, hip rotate, chest, leg. Complete in one line. Now hip, chest, leg. Now I want to go forward from my left leg. So I will activate my hip as a rotation. It activates the upper body, then leg. Boom. Boom. Cha, 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 cha. So the hip activate upper body. Got it? Okay, that's it.